Cryptic Comics. I got a question for you. Is knowledge truth? You decide. Hey everybody, it's me, Vince White, comic book creator, writer, artist, letterer, colorist. Well, maybe not a colorist, but uh, I try. Uh, you might know me uh, based off the comic I wrote called The Legend of Willpower. Well, I'm also doing another comic book called Flat. But enough of that. Um, let me move on with today's video. Uh, who is this? Who are you? Hey. Uh, hello? Um, who are you? Dude, your videos are cool. Uh, okay. Well, thank you for that, Mr. Purple Crackhead Martian. Uh, every once in a while, I guess we all need motivation and positive criticism, so... With that, let's move on to our presenter, Professor Flat. That's him right there. Yep. He's the professor of all things flat. And like every professor, he has a lab. This is his lab. Now, Professor Flat doesn't have PhDs or lofty degrees, but what he does have are questions. So, to the flat screen. That's right, here we can examine all things flat, and things that might not be flat, but could be. So, on to today's subject. The Horizon Line. That's right, we've all heard of it, seen it, dreamt of it, spoke of it in our dreams, and our aspirations. Maybe not, but it's this thing right here. Da -da 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 -da. Yep. The Horizon Line. And may I add, it is always flat. But, let's read what the description of said flatness might be. The horizon line, eye level, refer to physical visual boundaries where sky separates from land or water. Uh, it is the actual height of the viewer's eyes when looking at an object, the interior scene or exterior scene. That is the this definition, at least. Um, but I think the I think the really important thing is it's where the sky separates from the land. It's a very important definition. Um, the reason why this is so important is because what we think does not always line up with reality. Uh, I want to do an experiment to prove this point. So, Mr. Professor Flat, can you please change the picture? There we go. Now, given the choice between two pine trees or Christmas trees or evergreens, okay? Which is reality? The one with the triangles pointing uh, up and the wider base down or the triangles pointing down with the wider base up? If you selected this, you would be wrong. Because in reality, this is the true image. You don't believe me? Let's look at some. See, pine trees always reach up. They never reach down. They never do. But in our mind's eye, we have constructed this image. This is a very powerful concept. Why? Because our minds do not always reflect reality. Case in point, when we think of an airplane going down the runway and rising up into the air, our mind thinks that it will rise above the land and the horizon line will eventually drop away as the plane gets higher and higher into clear blue sky. But guess what? That's just a depiction of your mind, a construct. It is dead wrong. In reality, the horizon line never drops. 
as a plane takes off, it continually rises with the plane, with the pilot's uh, line of view. His horizon line is always present. This is a very important concept. A fact, it's not a concept. This is a very important reality. Because on a ball, the horizon line should eventually fall away. But in reality, no matter how far we look or how high we go, the horizon line keeps rising all the way out into space. Now, why is this important again? Because our mind and the concepts of things that we have does not always line up reality with reality. Look, think about it. We think Superman, when we draw him, me being a comic artist, we always draw him in clear blue skies, flying free and clear. But in reality, he would have a horizon line behind him all the time. Superman could never make it above the horizon line. This is very, very important. But here's the question. What if we did take a superhero and put him in reality and he did keep seeing the horizon and he realized wait this globe as he's been taught never falls below his line of sight what would happen next well you can find out what happened next back my comic get a copy of it it's called Flat on Kickstarter. Now, you can get the comic, poster, and card game. It's about one man's journey to becoming a superhero that's one of a kind. And he unlocks knowledge not meant for the faint-hearted. That's right, Flat. The comic, poster, card game. Go to Kickstarter right now, kickstarter.com. Type flat in the search bar, and you'll see the comic. It'll pull up. That's right. And I'll include a URL in the description below. Back flat the comic. See what happens. And let's spread this word through a whole new medium. All right, that's me, Vince White, Cryptic Comics. I'm out.